Yes, what happened? Did you finish? Yeah. Okay, just a minute because I need to finish. I need that everybody finish this. How are you doing? What do you think? Do you have any problem with that? Okay, you're almost finished. Okay, remember, don't speak Spanish. We need to speak in English. Okay, just check again. If the routine is correct, is this, is this has the order or no? Okay. Shh, don't translate. Oh, okay, because I, I listened you were translating. You, you don't have to do that. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Yes. You finish now? Are you sure? You are you sure? Maybe yes. Maybe do you think that the order? Okay, just one more minute and then we are going to do this the other part of the of this reading comprehension. We are gonna listen. You're gonna listen and then you're gonna check the order. Okay, if, if this is not correct, you have to order in that moment, okay? Well. And now pay attention and listen. Okay. Our listener question this week comes from Bert. Ma Ji is an English language teacher who okay. wants to know about the story. Let's start again, Walmart. please, because there was a problem. Our listener question this week comes Pay attention. from Bert. Carl Ma Ji is an English language teacher who wants to know about the store Walmart. Walmart is a group of large stores known for selling goods at a very low cost. The company sells many products, including food, clothing, electronics, and objects for the home. Sam Walton opened the first Walmart in 1962 in Rogers, Arkansas. Today, the company Walmart Stores Incorporated is the largest group of stores in the world. The company operates about 8,000 stores in 15 countries. It employs over 2 million people. Walmart made over $300 billion in sales last year. It recently opened its first store in India, a joint project with the Bharti group in Amritsar. There are about 4,000 Walmart stores in the United States. This number includes about 600 Sam's Club stores. Walmart is the largest private employer in America. Because of its size and influence with suppliers and buyers, Walmart's policies often receive wide public attention. For example, Walmart has received criticism over the years for its labor policies and lack of environmentally friendly efforts. Many critics say Walmart fails to pay its workers fairly or provide them with enough health insurance. In 2001, a group 
group of women took legal action against the company for sex discrimination. They accused Walmart of paying women less money than men and giving women fewer chances to get better jobs. The case later grew to include over one and a half million women who were current and former Walmart workers. In a separate case, Walmart agreed last year to pay hundreds of millions of dollars to workers who claimed they had been cheated of their hourly wages. Walmart has worked to improve its public image by becoming a more green company. It has decided to support selling more energy-saving products, such as low-energy light bulbs. It says it will work with manufacturers of high-energy products to try to improve energy use. The company has also started reusing materials and reducing the fuel use of its trucks. These efforts are good for the environment and also save the company millions of dollars. New Walmart stores have had a big effect on small communities in the United States. Some communities protest the arrival of a Walmart store because they say it endangers smaller local businesses. But others say that 